Hi there, I'm Matt Kemp from the Underground Cookery School. We do corporate team building. And I'm going to show you a number of couscous recipes today. Hi, today I'm going to show you how to make simple couscous. Well, the first step of the process is actually making the couscous, which is incredibly simple. Um, if you stick to these measures, you'll always be OK. I've got 250 grams of couscous. Um, try and keep it in a, um, a, a regular bowl rather than stainless steel because you don't want the couscous to inherit that flavour. I've got some stock here but you can use water or you can use stock cube. I've actually just got some on the, on the boil here so I'm just going to take that off and I'm going to measure up um, 400 millilitres. Um, so I've already got 300 in this pan so I'm just going to add an extra 100 making it up to 4. You can see the steam coming off of that so you know that it's hot. The key to this is it does have to be hot. Now I'm just going to add a few cubes of butter, a dash of olive oil and a little pinch of salt. And believe it or not, this is pretty much all that's required. I'm just going to mix those ingredients in. Um, it's, it's best if you can um, to make sure that they've evenly combined. So the butter cubes that I've got um, should be um, melted into that stock. Um, and all you have to do to cook couscous off is now, um, with that stock, is add it to the couscous, which I'm going to do now, like that. And as you can see, the couscous is now completely submerged in um, uh, the stock. But we're just going to leave it there for 10 minutes. 10 minutes is all it's going to take, and that will be beautifully cooked. Well. Um, 10 minutes has now passed and as you can see the water has been absorbed by the couscous and consequently it's now cooked. What I'm going to do is just flake that into this bowl. Now, um, or tray I should say, I, what I've done here is I've just um, um, avoided using stainless steel because as I um, uh, constantly bang on about, stainless steel does actually um, uh, have a flavour um, which is absorbed by the couscous. Um, so I just want to make sure it's nice and fluffy um, and now what we can do is plate the dish up. So um, the final part of the process is what, now it's nice and fluffy I'm just going to plate up. Um, now this is very much a vanilla recipe um, so I'm not going to add a great deal to it but you can put whatever you like on here. Uh, I've just got a little bit of chopped parsley just to dolly it up a little bit and um, if you're going to do that then you may as well add just a little bit of olive oil just to make it pretty and glisten. There we go. And just because I can, a little bit of black pepper around there. And that's a simple couscous recipe.